Are you looking for the best fishing reels in this video we will look at some of the best fishing reels on the market. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. Okumar Seamar C30. Thanks to a combo of smooth operation, awesome features, and quality construction, the Okumar Seamar C30 is the fishing reel that rose to the top of the fleet. Its smooth operation meant we could cast with ease and reel in something big without fighting against the reel and the fish. At 8 ounces, it's one of the lightest reels we tested and feels barely noticeable on many rods, making for a more balanced setup. We also like its utility as a small, lightweight reel to pack into the backcountry to find isolated, less often fished lakes and streams. It has a nice, solid aluminum bale with an oversized line roller, which helped keep our line in check. And when it comes to comfort, it has it in spades, including our favorite handle. The soft, either foam handle grip provided all-day comfort as well as a solid hold. As for drawbacks, this reel presents relatively few. We imagine the very comfortable foam handle grip may not stand up to the test of time. However, over hundreds of casts and several weeks of use, it has held up fine so far, without any signs of deteriorating. One should also note that this reel is quite small in comparison to many reels. We don't think this is bad, as its compact size is super packable, but it's worth mentioning. If you're looking for the best all-around fishing reel for performance and price, the Okumar Seamar C30 won't disappoint. Number 2. Daywar BG2500. When you're after saltwater fish, it pays to have a reel designed for the job. That's precisely where the Daywar BG2500 comes in. Its aluminum housing and waterproof drag system performed at the top of its class during weeks of fishing off of piers and jetties into the briny deep by our test team. Speaking of drag, it had plenty of power, which helped when fighting bigger fish. The drag dial was also one of our favorites, providing feedback with well-spaced clicks. The well-designed handle has a wide handle grip that offers comfort and impressive control. Another great feature was its anti-reverse system. It instantly locks the second you flip the switch. It was also a great casting reel, giving us long and accurate casts, something we especially appreciate when trying to place a lure into tight spots. The only real complaint we have about this reel is its bail. While it worked flawlessly during our testing, its thin wire design didn't match the rest of the reel's high quality. Overall though, if you want a versatile reel that excels in saltwater conditions, the Daywar BG2500 should be your top choice. Number 3. Cast King Centron 2000. If you are looking for a reel that performs admirably without breaking the bank, check out the Cast King Centron 2000. While this model lacks the superior construction found on higher-end reels, it makes up for it with its operation and features. The drag system gave us plenty of fighting power and was smooth throughout the drag range, while the instantaneous anti-reverse system ensured we didn't have any tangles after flipping the switch. This reel also features an excellent bail roller that kept our line in check while reeling. Its casting performance was also impressive, with the line coming off the spool effortless with every cast. Of course, with such a low entry point comes a few trade-offs. While it didn't give us any problems, the lightweight materials may not hold up over the long term, so you may have to be more cautious when using this one. There was also an issue with filling the spool with line too close to the top. Compared to other reels, this one ended up giving us a tangled mess when we did so. But if you're looking to save some cash while still getting a nice fishing reel, we recommend taking the Cast King Centron for a spin. Number 4. Pen Pursuit 3. The Pen Pursuit 3 is a price-pointed saltwater reel that proved more capable than expected. It might be smaller than other saltwater-specific reels, but it's strong and has plenty of fighting power. We learned this firsthand when successfully hauling in a fish that was seemingly too big for this reel. This reel also has one of our favorite features, a line capacity marker on the spool lets you know exactly how much line you have out. Very cool. While this model is marketed as a saltwater model, we found it to be up to snuff in freshwater angling environments, too. Our testers were big fans of the versatility that the Pen Pursuit offers. 
Although the pros are many, there are still a couple of downsides to consider in regards to this model. One of the most obvious is that there's no reverse. This means that instead of backreeling when fighting a big fish, you have to rely on the reel's drag system. Luckily, the drag system on this reel was wholly sufficient for the fish we caught. While the reverse feature might go unused by many anyway, it's still generally expected on a reel, and some might miss it. We do have an issue with the bail. It had the habit of closing prematurely while casting. While this could have just been an issue with the unit we tested, it's unfortunate to have this as a possibility. Overall, this reel surprised us with its strength and quality at a good price. If you don't need a high-end saltwater reel but still want a good one, the Pen Pursuit 3 is our price-pointed recommendation. Number 5. Abu Garcia Revo SX. If fishing is not just your hobby, but your lifestyle, then the Abu Garcia Revo SX is the reel to get. It's hands down the most well-built reel we tested, and its operation was equally impressive. It casts remarkably well, has exceptional line control, and packs plenty of features. Some of our favorites are the angled lip design on the spool, which helps improve casting distance, and the slow oscillation that gave us near-perfect line lay for fewer tangles. It also provided smooth drag no matter what level we dialed in. And since it's lightweight, it makes for a great travel setup when paired with a telescopic rod, something we appreciate after hiking a few miles to fish. Are there any downsides? Yes. For one, this is by far the most expensive reel we tested. And while it will most likely last for an extended period, the upfront cost is hard to swallow. It is also slightly more challenging to switch the handle to the opposite side than other models we tested, but that's not much to gripe about. Due to its high-end price, we recommend this reel only for truly dedicated, angling, lifers. If you want a fishing reel that will perform at the highest level, the Abu Garcia Revo SX is hard to beat. For what it's worth, we caught.